Hello everyone. Today I am going to discuss uh, another method to solve differential equations. It's the finite difference method. Now, in this method, uh, you have to replace the differential notation with some expressions. If the notation that is given is dy dx that is a degree is 1 then you have to replace it by this expression that is y i plus 1 minus y i minus 1 divided by 2 h similarly if the notation is in the order of 2 that is second order derivative if it is given that is d2 y dx2 then you have to replace it by this expression that is y i plus 1 minus 2yi plus yi minus 1 divided by h square. So, you have to keep these two expressions in mind before proceeding with the finite difference method. Now, let us look at the example to understand the finite difference method. The question is solve d2y dx2 plus y equals to 0. Our boundary conditions are y equals to 0 when x equals to 0 and y equals to 1 when x equals to 1 and the value of h has been given that is 0.25. Now our first task will be to replace the uh, differential notation by this expression. So I will rewrite the differential equation in the form of y i. So it will be y i plus 1 minus 2 y i plus y i minus 1 divided by h square plus y i is equal to 0. Now, now I will make this equation linear by multiplying h square with y i and 0. Therefore, our equation will become y i minus 1 plus h square minus 2 into y i plus y i plus 1 equals to 0. So, this is our equation. Now, what I will do? Now, I will put the value of h in this equation and then I will get the final equation as y i minus 1 plus Sorry. First of all, I will put the values of i here. Now, what I will, uh, what I, what values of i I will put? Since the boundary condition is x equals to zero and x equals to one, therefore, uh, and and also our h is zero point two five, therefore. I will be I the values of I will range from 0 to 3. So our y i minus 1 will be 0, y 0 plus I will put the value of h here. So it will become h square means 0.25 square minus 2 that is 1 point that will be minus minus 1.9375 y1 plus y2 equals to 0. Then I will move on to the next value of i that is i minus 1 will be 1. Therefore y1 minus this will again remain same 1.9375 y2 plus this will be y3 equals to 0. Similarly the next equation will be y2 minus 1.9375 y3 plus y4 will be equal to 0. So, this is our system of linear equations. This you can solve by any method. You can solve it by substitution method. You can solve it by cross multiplication or you can solve it by the Gauss elimination, matrix inversion, LU factorization, any method you like. So, 
on solving these three equations i will get y1 as 0.2943 now before that i must tell you here our y0 is nothing but 0 and our y4 is nothing but 1 since our boundary conditions you can see y0 is 0 and y4 is 1 why y4 1 because adding 0 0.25 to 0 we will get 0 0.25 this is the first one second 0 0.25 plus again 0 0.25 we will get 0 0.5 third 0 0.5 plus 0 0.25 it's 0 0.75 and last number 4 is 0 0.75 plus 0 0.25 is 1 so n equals to 4 therefore y4 is 1 so putting these values we can solve the uh, equations very easily now we will get y1 as 0 0.2943 y2 as 0 0.5701 and y3 is 0 0.8108 so we will get our values we can we will get all the values so y1 means 0. Point uh, y1 means is uh, y 0.25 y2 means y 0.5 that is the values of x the values of y at 0.25 is nothing but 0.2943 the value of y at x equals to 0 0.5 it is nothing but 0 0.5701 the value of y at x equals to 0 0.75 is nothing but 0 0.8108 and we know the value of y at x equals to 1 it is also 1 so this was how we can solve differential equation using the finite difference method thank you